Hi guys, my name is Alexi Mason and today in this video documentary, we are going to be discussing the impacts that urban environment has on our animals. Specifically, we're going to get into the air pollution. So here we go. You notice anything different in this video? You probably don't see anything, but people are just getting where they need to be in their cars. But in reality, cars are what's hurting our animals around us. Now, drivers spend about an hour to an hour and a half per day driving in total. And it can be in regular cars or other fueled vehicles. And according to the Serendip Studios, the exhaust from the cars contain like carbon monoxide, nitric oxide, nitrogen dioxide, hydrocarbons, and aldehydes. And these chemicals get released into the air and inhaled by animals. When inhaled by the animals, it goes in their lungs and can stay for up to several months. And the benzene in the car exhaust causes cancer. Sometimes it affects not only the animal directly, but it hurts the environment and what they use for food and protection. So, for example, Pollutants can damage trees, and here in Boston, we have many trees that our squirrels use for protection and for their shelter. Also, it increases the acid in lakes, and around here, the geese and ducks suffer from that greatly. To help further our knowledge on this, the air pollutants from cars and stuff, the CDC did test on rats to see the carcinogenic effects of exposure of exhaust on animals and they tested 95 rats and of those 95 15 of them had 17 lung tumors um, eight of them were classified as a bronchial alveolar adenomas and nine squamous cell tumors and also hyperplasia was present in 94 of the 95 rats however so not only were 15 affected but 94 of the 95 were affected as well just 15 of them were a little more serious unfortunately i wanted to do another thing on bees but i was not able to get any video but i feel bees are so essential to the environment that they do need to be talked about the nitrogen gases found in exhaust um have been known to mess with the bees recognition of odor which affects the colonies and how they pollinate. So they pollinate. In conclusion, in this video documentary, we talk about the harmful effects that our air pollutants are doing to our animals. Um, I don't think this needed to really be a long video documentary because we knew that inhaling gases are harmful, of course, but we probably were not aware of it affecting the animals around us. So since I am in Boston, the animals I see more around are squirrels, sometimes bees, and geese and ducks. Um, what we can try to do to help our animals around us is maybe just invest more in electric vehicles so that it can reduce the amount of pollution be put in the air and betters their chances for inhaling these toxins. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you learned something new or hopefully you'll learn to think more cautiously around the environment and how every little thing affects us. Thank you.